Violence in Cairo over the weekend reminds us that Egypt is mostly Muslim, but not entirely so. Several million Egyptians are Coptic Christians, and it was members of that minority group who clashed with Egypt's military over the weekend. At least two dozen people are dead, hundreds wounded, the worst violence since Hosni Mubarak was driven from power in February. We're going to talk about this with NPR's Soraya Sarhadi Nelson, who's on the line from Cairo. Hi, Soraya. Good morning, Steve. How did this happen? Well, this started as a peaceful protest yesterday afternoon. And what was happening was that many Christians had started marching on the state television building along the Nile River. They were joining another group of protesters there. And the, the thing that they were demanding from the government is protection from these uh, radical Muslim attacks that have been happening on churches and in Christian homes, uh, especially in the southern part of the country. And as they were walking, or as one group of protesters was going to meet the other, apparently some people in civilian clothes, it's unclear who they were, were um, started pelting these groups. Last name is Shane. 